Hello children, hope you all are doing well at your place. My name is Lindsay Thomas and I am the EVS teacher for UKG classes. You can call me Lindsay Miss. As you all know, because of the present scenario, you cannot come to school to meet your teachers and friends. But I'm sure things will get much better and we will see each other in school very soon. Till that time, be happy, smile, stay safe and we will meet each other through online classes. Now today, I have a surprise for you. You want to know what it is? Somebody is going to see you and I want everybody to close your eyes. Close your eyes. Now, open your eyes. Look who's here. It's a doll. Isn't she cute? Wow. I wonder what her name is. Let's ask her. Oh, she says, her name is Alia and she says she wants to be friends with you but she's feeling a little shy because she doesn't know you very well. Hello Alia, just relax, you're meeting everybody for the first time. So children, this happens to many of us most of the times. Sometimes a guest comes to our place. Or sometimes we have to meet people we don't know. Or it's all about making new friends. Sometimes we feel a little shy, a little, a little doubtful or a little scared. These feelings are all okay. I am here to give you a few tips to feel free and be confident to talk to your friends and about yourself. So are you ready? Let's start. So, when somebody asks me, what is your name? I will say, my name is Lindsay Thomas. Now, I am going to ask her, what is your name? She will have to say, my name is Alia. So, children, now it's your turn. I am going to ask you, what is your name? You will have to say, my name is. My name is. Now, let's check. How old is Alia? I'm going to ask her. How old are you, Alia? Oh, she says she's five year old. So tell me. How is Alia going to say that? She will have to say, I am 5 years old. So children, you are going to say, I am 5 years old. Children, please repeat, I am 5 years old. Okay. Children, Alia says she is studying in a school. So let's ask her. In which class is she studying? Alia, in which class do you study? She says she studies in UKG. So children, how will you say that? I study in UKG. I study in UKG. Good. So children, Sometimes people might ask you, do you have any brothers or sisters or do you have anybody at home to play with? They might ask you about your family members. So let's ask Alia. Alia, do you have any brothers or sisters? Alia says she has a brother and a sister. So how will Alia say that? 
I have a brother and a sister. Wow, Alia. You might be loving playing with them always. Am I right? Okay. Sometimes people will ask you about your favorite things. Now, do you know the meaning of the word favorite? Favorite means something that you love the most. It could be about your favorite color or maybe about the food that you love to eat or it could be your favorite toy, um, your special movie or your favorite cartoon that you always want to watch. Okay, so I think we'll ask Alia about her favorite color. Alia's favorite color is pink, she says. And she's asking me, what is my favorite color? Well, Alia, my favorite color is blue. And I know some children who has favorite colors and they love to buy things or toys with, that, with their favorite color. Look at Alia. She has worn her favorite color pink dress. Right, Alia? I understood that. Now, children, let me ask you, what is your favorite color? You will have to say, my favorite color is, let me repeat, my favorite color is. What about your favorite food, Alia? Alia says she loves idli and samba. She had that in the breakfast today morning and her mama says it's very healthy. <laughs> You're right, Alia mom. Your mama is definitely right. Idli and sambar is a healthy food. That's really nice, Alia. Children, I want to ask you, what is your favorite food? Then you will say, my favorite food is... My favorite food is... Now let's ask Alia one more thing. What do you like to do, Alia, when you are not in school or when you are having free time? Okay, Alia says she likes to do coloring and also to play with her ball. That's great, Alia. That's really nice. Let me ask you, Alia, are you feeling relaxed? And feeling confident to talk to your friends and teachers? Are you feeling okay now? So how about introducing to your friends about yourself? Are you ready? Okay, Alia says she is ready to introduce herself. So children, I want you all to listen to her very carefully. My name is Alia. I am five years old. I study in UKG. I have a brother and a sister. My favorite color is pink. My favorite food is idli and sambar. I like to do coloring and I also like to play with my ball when I am free. Wow, Alia, that's a great job. Children, I want you to clap for her. She was able to introduce herself and she wasn't shy. So everybody, please clap for her. Yay, Alia, that's really nice. So now, it's your turn to introduce yourself. I'm sure you're confident enough to do that. You can add more of your favorite things to your self-introduction. Also, I have an activity for you. It's a worksheet. It's called All About Me. It's a worksheet where you can paste your photograph as well as you can draw or stick pictures of your favorite things. 
we'll come to that. Now see, this is, this is your worksheet all about me. Here, my name is. You can take the help of your parents to write your name. You are also going to paste your photograph on this. I am dash years old. You are supposed to write your age in this. My favorite color. Please give your favorite color over here. You can color the crayon over here. In this page, you can draw or stick pictures. The thing I like to do when I am free. You can stick pictures in this. Maybe you love to play, you like to color, anything. My favorite toy. You can stick the picture of your favorite toy. Or maybe you can draw that. My favorite place to visit. You can write any of your place where you like to visit always. Maybe it's a mall, maybe it's a park, anything that you wish. My favorite food, that's easy enough. My favorite movie or TV show. You can stick the picture of your favorite movie or a TV show that you always like to watch. So children, I hope you understood everything. This is it for now. So, till we meet next time. Bye. Do you want to say something to Alia? You can say something to Alia. Alia says, bye. She loved meeting everybody. And maybe she might come to the next class. Bye for now.